Hi, I'm John Everett with Zern Industries. Today I'm very pleased to introduce you to a new product from the Zern Wilkins Group, and that is the ZW209H. It is an automatic control valve of the pressure reducing end of the pressure sustaining variety. Combination valve, one valve does both. Now, a brief explanation is probably in order. Most of you are very familiar with the pressure reducing function. Basically, we start with a high pressure, we've got to drop it to a lower pressure because we may have sensitive equipment or there may be a code requirement for us to drop that pressure. So that's a very straightforward function that most everybody understands. But what they don't typically understand is the sustaining function. This particular valve can also maintain a minimum inlet pressure. So in other words, let's say for example again, we've got high inlet pressure coming into the valve, we need to reduce the pressure for equipment downstream. We may have equipment tied to that high pressure side of this valve that, that has to have a given pressure in order for that equipment to function correctly. So to make a hypothetical, let's say we have 150 on the inlet, we'll set the reducing valve such that we're getting 50 on the outlet but we have to be cognizant of this inlet pressure dropping down below a critical value. That's where the sustaining function comes in. So what we would do in that particular case is we would set the sustaining function such that if this inlet pressure ever dropped down to a given value, which we would adjust, we would set that pressure ourselves, this valve would begin to close itself off. Thus, it's going to maintain a given inlet pressure. Again, this may be for an application whereby we have some equipment attached to the inlet side of this line, and again, we need to reduce pressure downstream, but the equipment attached to the inlet side may be very pressure sensitive, and if that pressure falls too low, that could harm that equipment. So once again, just to hit upon what the valve does, it's a reducing valve and a sustaining valve. There are two pilots associated with this. The sustaining pilot maintains that inlet pressure. In other words, we will adjust this regulator or this pilot here such that if this inlet pressure ever falls down below a critical value, the valve will shut itself off. By doing so, that would cause a rise again in that inlet pressure, protecting that sensitive equipment from ever going down to a pressure that's too low for it. The other pilot is a pressure reducing pilot and as we said, this will go ahead and knock the pressure on down to the downstream piping for that equipment that can't tolerate the high pressure. So in the event that you need a valve whereby we do need to reduce pressure for downstream equipment, but we also need to maintain that pressure for upstream equipment, the ZW209H pressure reducing and sustaining valve would be the proper valve for you. I would strongly encourage you to get on the website at zern.com and take a look at this product, or if you have very specific questions, feel free to call us. We're happy to help you. That's what we're here for. We want to encourage you to call us, and we'll give you all that information that you could possibly need on this particular product. Thank you for watching. For more information, please subscribe to our One Zern YouTube channel. Call our customer care center at 1 855 1 Zern and visit us at zern.com.